Well, we got a couple minutes left, so that okay. means we're going to start talking about the okay, bourbon good. now. We're going to bring Eric onto the show. Eric's the founder of the event, and he's going to tell us what we're drinking and why. So what do we got? So we have Iron Root Harbinger XC. And the reason I brought this on is because, you know, you're, as you just said, very focused on women entrepreneurs. Yeah. Now, Iron Root isn't run by women. It's run by two brothers in Dennis in Texas. But the reason why this tastes the way it does and how it's made is because of a woman named Nancy Fraley. She, in the industry, she's known as Nancy the Nose Fraley. Oh. And she discovered at a young age, she had this ability to be able to pick up minute qualities, smell, taste, and that kind of thing. So after a bouncing around and, and whatever, I mean, she got her law degree. Like she, it was very clear, maybe she didn't necessarily know where she was going. Uh -huh. She decided to start this business. It's actually called uh, Nosing Services. It I love like it. And so now she works with distilleries to be able to find like specific impurities and things like that. And she actually created this. Love this is the that. craft whiskey wow. aroma wheel. Hmm. And she created this for, you know, everyone to be able to use and like really define what these different flavors are. And, you know, I thought that was uh, super appropriate and also got me thinking about, you know, we're all to a degree consultants and yeah. how much and that allows you to have a different level of impact than you would if you were just running one yeah. business and yeah. you're helping people. And I'm often very surprised how, as just a web developer and working on people's websites and larger companies, how much I get involved in well, okay, well, what's your sales mm -hmm. process look like? Mm -hmm. Well, how are you marketing? You know, how are you doing all of these different things? And and it really allows you that, and where she's having this huge impact on the industry because she's working with a lot That's of so cool. craft whiskey brands. Uh-huh. That's wow. so cool. And thank you for the thoughtfulness that you put into this to bring yeah. a woman into it. And mm -hmm. I want to know what you do with the rest of the bourbon after your tasting here. <laughs> we put it over there. Okay. Oh, okay. Great, 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 <laughs> great. Sure, yeah. yes, yes. So, Eric, are we going to sniff this and you're going to tell us where we're on the Oh, I, I have a cold, Nick. So. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I get it. Yeah. But, yeah, I don't. Yeah. We'll I, got, we'll I, got yeah. I got nothing. I got nothing. We'll explore that after the show. We'll see yeah. if we can figure that out. If you want to hear more bourbon stories, check out these videos. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button. It would mean the world to us. You can also find us on social. We are at Bourbon Fridays on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, LinkedIn, and TikTok. See you next time.